75,000 square feet of darkness spanned across three floors. One of the most haunted places in Wisconsin, the Berlin Tannery. Started in the early 1900s as the Sears Hitchcock Tannery, there has been many odd occurrences. September 4, 1923 brought a small fire, which was thought to be under control. However, when workers returned in the morning, the building was engulfed in flames. The tannery was moved to its current location, an old cranberry storage facility. During its days of operation, the tannery received a human hide whose origin is still unknown. The owner, Dan Hoppe, was pronounced dead at the tannery after trying to save a worker from a tank of fumes. Upon arriving at the hospital to ID the body, his wife found him sitting up on his stretcher, fully alive. In 1987, the business was transferred overseas. Although the tannery holds no reported deaths, it's still a hot spot for paranormal activity. There's rumored to be a portal on the second floor that allows all things paranormal to come and go as they please. There have been reports of women being held down, touched, scratched, disembodied screams, heavy footsteps, door slams, dark shadows. Numerous questions have been answered, and some of the ghosts have even been identified. Sid. Steve. Jim. Eddie. Janet. And Megan, who likes to hang out in this basement. Eddie, put your hand out, Sheila, see if it'll touch your hand. He just took it right out of my hand. What did? I, I don't know, my meter just right out of my hand. Who's in this room? Oh my god. Did you hear that voice? Yeah. You heard that too? Yeah. Hello. Fox Valley ghost hunters have been guiding tours, scavenger hunts, and overnight stays for the past four years. Reserve your spot now. Visit our website at www.fvghosthunters.com or find us on Facebook at Fox Valley Ghost Hunters.